The mathematical symbol of today is the restriction for maps, denoted with such a vertical line. And usually on the left hand side you find a map F and at the index you find a set A. Now since on a fundamental level in mathematics we often deal with maps and sets, this restriction operator occurs very often. Indeed, this whole thing here just denotes a new map when we already have a map F. More precisely, you would start with a map F defined on a set X. And the codomain we call Y, so we map into Y. However, now we want to change the domain, so we look at a subset A of X. This means now that this F restricted to A should be a map that is only defined on the set A. So the domain is A, but we still map into Y. And now the only question we have is, how can we define this new map we could call the restriction of F to A. Indeed, the definition is very simple, because it should do the same as F itself. This means, if we put in an X, we get the same result, no matter which function we use. However, you should note here, for our new map, we are only allowed to use points X that come from the set A. So you see, the reason for introducing this new map is not for calculating the values. Rather, we use it if we want to work with the map as an object, but now defined on a smaller set. Therefore, you see this symbol very often when you learn mathematics. So, I hope that this was helpful and that I see you in the next video. Bye!